Hey guys, welcome back. This is Ashok from TechEB and today we have new ROM for MIA1 and which is known as AOSIP Android Open Source Illusion Project. As you can see the software information, model is MIA1, Android is 8.1 with a security patch of 5th May 2018. And the best part of this room is this also supports OTA update. So if any update available, you can check it out over here. This will be the first look of your room. Long pressing home screen going to home settings, which gives you many options to customize the home screen, app drawer, icon pack and miscellaneous. Under quick setting panel, you can find some amazing tiles available like you have navigation bar, Caffeine, head up notification, screen recorder, ambient display, always on display. Talking about camera, camera gives you decent picture quality and it has lots of settings available like picture quality can be changed to standard, high or low, face detection, ISO, touch focus duration and red eye reduction. Moving inside the settings, here you will find an option called Owl's Nest. In this, there are lots of customization options and it is very well organized. Under status bar itself, you can find all the customizations related to status bar like career label, clock, icon and traffic. Other than that, you also get few gestures over here, which includes AOSP gestures like swipe fingerprint for notification. And when you slide down, you can see the notification. And if you also want to clear these notification, you just swipe right or left on the fingerprint scanner. Other than that, you also get advanced settings over here, which consist of app operations where you can control the permissions of the apps. Then you have suspended actions in which you can enable and control the background usage of the applications once the screen is off. This room also comes with a new theme engine. So going to display system theme here, you can see you have four options available, automatic, light, dark and black AF. You also have lots of ascent color options. and things like fingerprint scanner, double tap to wake, double tap to sleep. Everything is working fine. Volti is working, but you don't get the native calling feature inside the dialer app. So guys, these were the customization options and features available on this room. Now talking about the benchmark results, going with Geekbench application, and under this results are pretty amazing. Single core scores 897 wherein multi core scores 4437. And in Android 2 benchmark application it scores 81075. There are no lags found on this ROM. It is pretty smooth and while usage there are no hitting issues. Everything is working fine. Pretty smooth till now. Talking about battery life. In my first cycle, I got somewhere around 6 hours and 5 minutes of screen on time. And I would recommend you guys to use this ROM as a daily driver as it's pretty smooth, there are no lags. And installation process, I have made a dedicated video which you can find it in the description below. So guys, as of now, only this much in this video. Hope you like the video and if you like the video, then do give me a thumbs up. Also, if you are new to my channel, then do not forget to subscribe the channel. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.